Papiere und Pass. Alles in Ordnung. Guten Tag. Thank you kindly. One charge in the right place could turn that gate into kindling. Special delivery! Praise the Lord. Fucking stairs.
suche, ich suche! Gut, gütiger, das war knapp. Reckon I ought to check in with Skylar. You're alive. Nothing's getting past you, mate. Where's Skylar? I cannot tell you that. Can't or won't? Miss Sinclair's prison whereabouts are classified. So, did you kill the bastard? No. Not yet. It takes a hard heart and a steady hand to face a man like Derker. I should have sent a real soldier. Too bad you were too busy wanking off in church. Tell Bishop this isn't over. Derker will be taking a dirt nap this time next week. I think it's time I got back to Paris. Veronique is probably worried sick about me.
John! Where have you been? At the beach. Is that seaweed on your collar? I got a bit homesick. Started swimming back to Ireland. Till I remembered something I had to tell you. What was that? You're a bold lass, Fernique. Bollocks like brass boulders you have. And you're old enough to know your mind. I won't say otherwise. Is that your idea of an apology? It'll do. Well, well, pleasure indeed, my petites. I have been saving this bottle for very special occasion. Sean, I did not know you were back. Aye. Just in time for happy hour. Or did you have another rare pleasure in mind? I am afraid we are short on glasses. I'll go dig one up. Enjoying the spoils of war, are we? Struggle must be going well. The resistance grows stronger every day. Last night we were contacted by another cell on the west side of the city. They want to join us. You trust these people? Not yet. But we cannot pass up the chance to forge an alliance. Actually, I was hoping you would look into it for me. I can see you're busy here. To reach the western district, one must pass through security checkpoints. My face is well known to the Nazis. Veronique offered to go in my place. <laughs> I'm sure she did. But I'll go just the same. I'll need transit papers. Santos can get forged travel documents. I'm sure you can work something out. Tell Veronique I'll take a rain check on that drink. Dios mío! It's Lazarus! Back from the dead. My friends in Laura told me about your little balloon adventure. You must be part bird or part fish to be standing here talking to me now. What about me, Irish Lock? No one's that lucky. My friends tell me you can get forged travel papers. Ah, I see. The hero of Ilet still has you running his errands, eh? Why not pick up his laundry while you're at it? Oh, that's fucking funny. You're gonna be picking up your own teeth in about ten seconds. Tranquilo. Luke mentioned that you might be stopping by. Your papers have been prepared. Quality workmanship. Not cheap. Put it on Luke's tab. <laughs> you Irish have a brilliant sense of humor. I'm running a business here. You want to talk to me? Talk business. Oh, for fuck's sake, Santos. Just tell me what you want. Ah, that is more like it. You see, I cannot tolerate competition. Why would the crowd soldiers buy cigarettes and booze from me when they could get them cheaper from the army? Maybe you should try dressing up in a clown suit, hand out free balloons with every pack of smokes. Maybe I should hire a badass Irishman to blow up the German supply trucks. That'll work too. A German supply convoy stopped to make repairs not far from here. The trucks are, as you say, sitting ducks. I'll handle it. And you'll have those papers ready when the job's done. Claro que sí. I'll see you soon.
There's a lot of spare fuel lying about. With a disguise and some explosives, I could light the whole place up. There's more than one way to skin a cat. There's people fighting for you out there. Sterben! Kolwohl! you been? I've been looking all over the city for you. If you're back in Paris, come find me at the garage behind the Belle de Nuit. Vittore. When I heard you were back, I prayed that this vendetta of yours was finished. Your eyes tell me it is not. Dirk is still breathing. So what? 
Would you trade your own life for his? Aye, gladly. Then you are a fool. Only grave diggers profit from such madness. Jules is owed a debt. I'd see it paid in full. This isn't about Jules! Have you forgotten why you had to flee Ireland in the night? Have you forgotten what happened to your father? You, of all people, know the price of revenge! How much it costs the people we love! I took you into my home. Made a better life for you. You have no right to throw it away. I can't turn away now. I've made my choice. I'm sorry, Vittori. You'll have to live with that. Takes the edge off this does. Your competition has been royally banjaxed. Those supply trucks shan't trouble you again. All is fair in business as well as war, no? To be honest, sometimes I cannot tell the difference. I'll have those papers now. Ah, yes, uh, the papers. I'm afraid we have a very tiny problem there. It's a trivial matter. Uh, a small additional payment should cover it. What's this bollocks? We had a deal. Yes, of course. However, the price of forged papers has gone up. I blame it on the bad economy. Too many rules, too many soldiers with guns. How do they expect an honest man to make a living in this city? I'm just about at the end of my rope, Santos. Tell me how much it'll cost to get those papers. If I don't like the number, they're gonna be fishing you out of the river with a fucking boat hook. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Just bring me the money. Then go get yourself laid, Irishman. It's not healthy walking around with all that bent up aggression. You see, that wasn't so hard, was it? Here are your new travel papers. Just show them to the guards at the Nazi checkpoint. These had better be the real McCoy. Why would I want to get you killed, Irishman? You are my best customer! 